welcome to another episode of Fucking Easy Food Prep. Healthy food you actually want to eat. So today we've got a really special recipe. We're making um, choc orange casein brownies. These are going to blow your mind. Choc orange marmalade? Choc orange marmalade, yeah. Well, choc orange, but we're going to add marmalade in it. We think that it'll be nice, don't we, Mel? We think so. Yeah, we don't know, but we're pretty sure. Like, this we'll is a good, a go. This is a good solid brownie um, uh, recipe. So using our new saturated clean casein, 100% casein, okay. grass-fed cows, made in Australia, no preservatives, no additives, no flavourings, no nothing, just casein, which is awesome because so many protein powders out there these days are just full of shit, shit aren't yeah, they? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So this is... It's good, it? it's good. It's really good. And it's slow digesting. So you can have it any time of the day and it's going to keep you full for longer and also great to have before you go to bed. So these... The good thing about this is it's going to up the protein content of these uh, brownies. So you always want to have mm. protein and carbs and some fat at every meal. So this, this is going to be really, really great. Um, so we've got three... You use three scoops of the um, clean casein. One and a half blocks, Mel. One and a half blocks of the 70% lint chocolate. And two tablespoons of coconut, coconut oil. Coconut oil. I melted this um, in the microwave. Just like do it every, like do it say yeah. for 20 seconds stir, then 10 seconds stir, because yeah. you don't want to burn it. Mm. So. Yeah, and she didn't, which was awesome. Um, I didn't burn it. Three quarters of a cup of white sugar, two eggs, three tablespoons of milk, and then we're just going to see what we think with the <laughs> marmalade. We'll put it all in and then we'll go. mix the marmalade yeah. in. So once you've melted that, um, next thing you're going to put in is the uh, eggs and the sugar in the milk. Um, so I'll, what did I say? Two eggs, hey? Yeah. yeah. And we're going to use an electric beater to mix it in. And I'll get do the milk. Three tablespoons, didn't we say? We did. Where's our tablespoon? Do we have? Oh, here it is. Oh, sorry, here, sorry. Right. Now, uh, I think we've got a long enough extension cord. We have our industrial trade <laughs> extension. Extension cord. Oh, preheat the oven to 180 degrees and line a tin. Yeah. All right. She didn't even know how to trade you to go with it, though. Yeah. A hot one. Love yeah. She <laughs> didn't really have to be that hot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mel likes them a bit on the chubbier side with tattoos. Uh, manly. Oh, sorry, manly. manly. Hairy. 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 Manly. Okay, so we're going to mix this together. Up high? I think about medium, maybe. All Just, right. Yeah, yeah. And then we're going to gradually um, add in the casein. Maybe what we could do, Mel, is just drizzle the marmalade on top, do you think? So it has like a marmalade topping. I reckon we put it in there. Do you think? Do you think, I it, think. Do think I it might go a bit watery though? And, and All right. Yeah, I reckon. Right. Well, blaming you if it doesn't work. Okay. Okay. Oh, you could probably even put it in instead of the milk. Because you want yeah. the milk into it. Make it a bit runny, don't you? Just gonna gradually. Mel's gonna be the mixer. Ooh. Sorry. <laughs> Maybe we needed a deeper bowl, kid. <laughs> yeah, I think this is best done with an electric beater. Because it's just easier to mix. Oh, do you want me to do that? Oh, you got it? I got it. I'm a chef now, remember? Yeah. She's the master chef. Mm -hmm. Oh. It's a bit puffy. Yeah. Oh, it's looking good. It oh, this will be amazing. Good. You smell the chocolatey? Oops, sorry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, one more scoop. Good. The ice cream we just made oh, on with top the brownie. Of these. Oh, yes. this would be a fucking amazing. Yeah. Do you know what I think though? I think with the marmalade we should just stir it in. Not okay. blend, do you reckon not blend it in? Because it's like if you blend it in though, it will yeah. get rid of them big chunks of Yeah, but you know it'd be in. nice to have that big orange like you get every now and then you get this right, knocked down. Yeah. I don't know why even why yeah, you're yeah, I know, me. yeah, I know exactly. But this, we're doing it like this, all right? I know. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> oh, God, this is going to be amazing. Nice and fluffy, isn't it? Mm. Okay. 
Yeah. Felt like casein all over me. So just really mix that through till it's. Do you want me to scrape the side for you? Yeah. yeah. Just get all the side. You don't want to waste any of that good casein. Taste it now. Is it good? Oh yeah. Oh. Oh yes. All right. Now the marmalade is optional, so you yeah. can either just have it plain or you can um, add the marmalade in. So once that's all fully... I reckon it's done. Yeah, I reckon it's good too. We need our spatula that Nikki gave us, don't we? Winston and I are gonna lick the right, Yeah. So, again, remember this is optional, the marmalade. So I'm gonna put in one, two... Oh, that's really well, How many good. tablespoons more do you reckon? Three or four? Go four. Okay. We like marmalade. Do it, do it properly. Yeah. It's a really great blog on the benefits of marmalade on Emma's um, Emma's website. So Mel's just going to stir that through. I don't really think that we need the milk because this is um, this is quite yeah. a good consistency. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that looks good. Yeah, that looks good. Now, um, you know what else? You could add like raspberries in there or anything really if you didn't want to do the marmalade. Um, anything. Cherries. Cherries. Or you just do it plain. Just like plain. Okay, so now we're going to pour it into this, um, into here, you hold it up and I'll, I'll use the spatula. You alright? Yeah. yeah. Just going to scrape it in. Ah! Sorry. <laughs> oh, I'm the bowl mill. Okay. Oh, sorry. That's it. <laughs> we're on co uh, <laughs> So just scrape it all in. Lucky we had our good spatula. Nikki was like, watched us for however many episodes, like, God, you guys need a bloody spatula. Okay. So, then... You're going mm. to just whack it in the oven for about 18 minutes. Um, and then you want to get it out and let it just completely cool before you actually cut it. And it'll be nice and real dense and just delicious. So I'm just going to pop that in there. All right, Mel, what's 18 minutes from now? It's uh, 12.18. Okay, cool. All right, there you go, everyone. Enjoy. Um, head over to Saturay, www.saturay.com.au and grab uh, your casein. And don't forget to email us for the free recipe book. We'll see you next week. Bye. Bye.